Ted Nugent spoke to the Republican Party in Maricopa County, Arizona. That's, of course, Joe Arpaio's stomping ground. He's the insane uh, right-wing sheriff. And uh, Nugent was asked if he would help build a wall on the southern border. Now, his response may be a little difficult to hear because of the audio quality, but try to listen here, and then we'll come back and break it down. His answer is amazing. Can you, uh, as a good uh, uh, patriot, uh, come back sometime soon and uh, help us raise funds to build a uh, fence along the California border? All right. And all the everyone from here has an opportunity to fight and cross. Yeah! <laughs> yes, I would do that. If you let us stand on the border and shoot me. <laughs> These are invaders. They're invading our country. Yeah. We can't invade Mexico. They will shoot us. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody can invade any place except people can invade America. What is what is that? You know, let me tell you, I got I got the border thing down. I have a border. Cookie. Oh, beautiful ranch in Texas. Everybody knows where my property lies on. I wish I could read that. The first time I caught a trespass. But I don't want to scare the little right. shit out of you. <laughs> but I made it very clear for the Beretta 12 gauge and a three and a half inch double lock button. Have you ever shot a three and a half inch double lock button? It's like a wall of lead. Yeah. After that first encounter, we had no border crossing problems. Now, I'm not kidding you. They know I will shoot them. Okay, uh, thank you very much, Ted Nugent. You just advocated for murder. That's not me putting spin on it. That's not me taking it too far. That's not me extrapolating. He said it right there multiple times. First of all, he said, well, the first time I caught a trespasser in Texas, uh, I threatened them with a gun. That's what he's saying. And then at the end, you heard him say, I would shoot them. They know I'd shoot them. If I see somebody crossing the border, I would shoot them. But then I don't know if you caught it because the audio was a little worse earlier on. But he said to the question, hey, will you help us build a, a wall on the southern border? He said, if you let me stand, quote, if you let me stand on the border and shoot invaders. I don't see any gray area. I don't see... He's being crystal clear here. He's being very straightforward and very direct. He's saying, yeah, I, I'll, I will shoot the invaders. They know I'll shoot them. When I saw somebody crossing the border in Texas, which is a story I don't believe, by the way, but he said, when I saw somebody crossing the border, I threatened them with a gun. Yeah. This guy has, uh, on multiple occasions, alluded to his Christianity. His Christian beliefs? <laughs> is that what Jesus would do? Jesus sees somebody trying to escape poverty and depravity and the drug war, living in a narco state. They're going to kill their kids. And he sees him crossing the border. Jesus is like, you know, I really should kill those people. I don't think that was his message. I don't think that was his point. And in fact, we went over, I've given you before on the show, at least six or seven quotes from the Bible on the issue of immigration. That's one of the issues in the Bible where they are the most liberal, right? Like you could argue the Bible is probably the most liberal on economic issues in the New Testament and in the New Testament on war issues. But more than anything, immigration. The quotes on immigration, they're like, treat you have to treat the immigrants like your neighbors, like your family, like the people who are already among you. You have to show them hospitality. It, you have to do that. That's what the right thing to do is. And Ted Nugent's like, I don't give a fuck about my own holy book, the own teachings from my own God. Fuck that. I'm going to take the gun and threaten to kill people. And then also... These are the guys, man, who claim, like, uh, us? Racist? No, 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 no. Never that. Never that. Oh, really? So, uh, would Ted Nugent, or has Ted Nugent said anything along those lines when it comes to people who cross the Canadian border? Or people who fly in here from other countries and then just stay? White people from other countries. Nope. Never has, never will. You and I both know that. And we've gone through the laundry list of other racist statements that Ted Nugent has made. He called President Obama a subhuman mongrel. Yeah, no racial undertones or overtones or 
in-your-face blatant racism there. I know. It's us liberals reading too deep into the situation. But my question for other conservatives who are self-described as moderate, does it bother you that this guy's in your camp? Does it? Do you go like, eh, it's kind of fucked up and weird that he votes for the same people I vote for? I mean, remember, you guys like to think of yourself as the party of morality and family values. Is it family values to kill a kid crossing the border when their mother wants the kid to be safe? Is it family values to murder a human being? Is that morality? You know, they always scream, moral values. But when they talk about moral values, they're talking about, hey, let's discriminate against gay people, let's pray to Jesus, uh, let's invade other countries. They don't view morality as like, don't do murder. Because in their mind, it's like, well, if we're talking about murder of the other, well, then it's cool. He totally bought in, hook, line, and sinker to the, the tribalism myth. The idea of like, we're the good people by definition, they're the bad people. So when we murder them, when they cross the border, it's totally cool. Now, stop and think for a second. If there were uh, people crossing the border into Mexico, white people from America going into Mexico, would Ted Nugent be cool if they flipped the script on, on us? And if they said, well, we're just going to murder any white people, any Americans that cross the border into our area. Would Ted Nugent say, oh, come on, guys. Let's be principled here. They have a border. They want the border to be respected. So they responded how they thought was fitting, and it makes sense because they're invaders going into their country. Us American, us, us Americans, us white people are invaders when we go into their country. So they should, they should be able to shoot Americans when they cross the border. He would never say that. And of course, Ted Nugent is an intellectual midget because what's the reality about immigration in America overall? We are a nation of immigrants. Have you read that thing on the Statue of Liberty? You might want to check it out. It'll clue you in as to what our ideology is supposed to be. And if you're so concerned about uh, immigration, well, Ted, you should get the fuck out of the country. Because the real original Americans are the Native Americans. And of course, we did the Trail of Tears, and we did the Indian Removal Act, and we did a genocide. And we stole the land. So you're only starting your line of thinking when it's historically convenient for you. You're not really being objective. If you really want to be a hard ass about immigration and let's be principled, then you should say, okay, well, we were fucked up to take from the Native Americans in the first place, so let's give it all back to them and get the fuck out of here. But you're not. You're not willing to be objective because you're not a serious thinker. In your mind, I'm good, they're bad. Republicans are good, they're bad. White people are good, they're bad. Anything we do is okay, so even though I say I love Jesus, I will advocate for murder. Stay classy, pal. Why don't you shit your pants again and refuse to go fight in the war in Vietnam as you claim to be more moral and more brave than everybody else?